Today, we are vinegar pickling red onions. In general, pickling is the process of soaking food in a solution that prevents spoilage. In this case, I used vinegar, an acidic liquid, to prevent the growth of bacteria that would spoil the vegetables. You can also use a brine made from salt and water to preserve vegetables using lactic acid fermentation. But vinegar pickling is usually easier and faster. For this recipe, I used half a cup of apple cider vinegar, and then I added one cup of distilled water. I also added a teaspoon and a half of salt. The salt is just for flavor. It's not in high enough of a concentration to cause significant lactic acid fermentation. I also added a tablespoon of white sugar. The sugar just adds sweetness, which helps balance out the acidity of the vinegar. Next, you want to stir the solution to make sure all the salt and sugar is fully dissolved. I also added black peppercorns for a little bit of flavor. And now it's time to chop our red onion. I used one large red onion and I chopped it into thin strips just like this. The next step is to blanch the onions. Blanching is the process of pouring boiling hot water over the vegetables. In many vegetables, there are natural enzymes that cause the vegetable to ripen over time. These enzymes are still active after the vegetable has been harvested. Blanching inactivates these enzymes so that the enzymes can't significantly change the color and flavor of the vegetables after they've been pickled. I let the onions sit in the boiling water for about a minute and a half and then I just drain the water and now my onions were ready to be canned. I used clean mason jars to store the onion and then poured my vinegar solution into each jar. I let the jars cool down completely before closing the lids and storing them in the fridge. And that's a little bit of the science behind pickling red onions. It's only been about one day since I pickled these red onions and look how much they've changed already. I find the flavor gets even better the longer you wait. I hope you enjoy.